What's up guys, he King here bringing you another live a reaction to this week's and final episode of Marvel's The Falcon and the Winter Soldier, episode 6. So yeah, I'm looking forward to this, 48 minutes long, hope it's good, hope it wraps everything up in a nice little bundle, and I'm going to be eating breakfast, I mean technically it's 1.20 but you know, I had to go out, come back and I'm starving, so please do not mind me. <laughs> And I apologize in advance. And again, no footage unless I can somehow edit it. I tried. I did try last week to include footage, but YouTube wouldn't accept it. Even though I did it under 10 minutes of the of the supposed rule, they wouldn't accept it. They kept getting blocked. So screw them. And screw this. So yeah, uh, just do a watch along. So and plus you get the full reaction as well and me eating. Starting now. No subtitle tracks, that's disappointing. What if what what if Isaiah is the is the power broker? <laughs> There we go. I love how they're just chilling there, like. We're gonna see Falco in the suit! The face came back! That's funny. It was News and Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. But I, I was watching a reaction from Winter Soldier. They were like, that never came back in the main. That's like a pumpkin bomb. Imagine the power broke is Norman Osborn. Oh my god, look at the suit, yo!
Are we going to get an end credit scene of Captain America on the moon? Oh. Oh. The rope. But he's work. He's working for Sharon, though. It's like, isn't that the lady or I, I don't get what Sharon's endgame here is. Oh, here we go. She was obviously stalling you, so I don't... Oh, is he? Was that smoke? Yeah. Oh, that was an extra. Oh, wow. What the hell? That's acid. Damn it. You've got some leaving by truck and some by helicopter, like. Yeah. I love that they're giving the uh, uh, belt truck more to do. Like it's great. Oh. That is awesome, yo. Catching it.
Or is he gonna hit it? Like kick it like he did in Civil War? Or oh oh. Pretty sure that's not how helicopters work, right? Okay. Red Wings back. Yep, so he's gonna kill he's gonna kill that incapacitate him and he's gonna incap inca incapacitate that person. Oh my god. No it doesn't, it just ma it just makes it worse, like Is it? Is it though? Honestly, they're not the most compelling villains in this, in the MCU. I get their cause, but... Are they gonna crash? What? That was sick, yo. And the whole thing's vibranium, right? So. Falcon is awesome in this, yo. Is it even Falcon anymore? It's Captain America, man. Bucky, come on. Break this dude's face. Oh, Walker is here. Oh, he's he would. Yeah. He's a Well, that's not doing anything. That shield is is, is not good. What do you think was gonna happen?
Yes. Beat their asses. They're not going to listen. You got to beat them. Smack them up, man. Break their bones. Bucky, Bucky. Put in your earbuds. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh. oh, it's awesome, he injects. Oh! Oh, smack! That was amazing. Well, that dude's alive. Yeah, I gotta sort this out. We're not even halfway through the episode yet, and so much is happening. Crush. Killer, I don't like her character, killer. I really couldn't care if she lives or dies. Ugh. You're weak, man. Even with the so super soldier serum, you're pathetically weak. What are you doing? You're gonna have to make a choice, Walker. Revenge or just, or, you know, justice. Come on. Don't be an asshole. Do the right thing. Do the right thing. Do the right thing, dude. Come, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Redeem yourself, man. Yo, help him. Oh, he's got two red wings. Awesome.
There we go. A bit cheesy, but I like it. You need that, man. Oh, oh. Oh, power broker. It's Sharon. It's Sharon at this point. It has to be. Oh, no. Bot truck. What's he doing? But he's working for it, though. Like the call. Oh, God. Yeah, take care of him. For the love of Christ. Oh, man. I'm, I'm kind of scared that, like, one of them's going to die. Is he doing bird whistles and shit? That's awesome. Who's gonna fight who? Oh. She's the power broker, yeah. I've been saying it since episode three, like, that the episode was called The Power Broker, and we never... Yeah, I, I said it, yeah. 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 Well, it was going to... No, he's going to die. He's going to die now. A shame. Well, there's, there's... She got shot in return. That's
ねえ He's not gonna. F- Yeah, you should have you should have asked for a helmet or something, dude. Like, like protect your head, man. Like. Uh, at least he didn't uh, betray his convictions. What is that? Sam tried, man. He tried, but, you know. It's interesting, though. Like, uh, Steve got shot so many times by Bucky at Wittersold, and he he still survived, like. Yeah, no, I guess I guess the shots were fatal, man. Oh, yeah. That suit is amazing. I, lo- I, love, the, I love the new suit. But, um, damn, man, Sharon being a bad guy, like. It's like an angel coming down, man. It's awesome. Can't they just extract the uh, super uh, serum blood from them, or? Is she... She's dead, right? Like I'm so glad Walker didn't
Sen şu. Yeah. yeah, it's got a bit too preachy, but that's interesting. Insane God, Thanos. <laughs> I love that suit, man. I, I just, oh. Does she have the super soldier serum in her? Are they going to ask him for the shield back or... Yeah, I was wondering about that. Sorry, battery was running out. What's going on here? They're going to the raft? They're going to get killed. They're going to get assassinated. They're going to get blown up. Oh, oh, interesting. Oh, they're dead. Sharon? No, who's that? Oh, Zemo's butler. <laughs> this guy, yeah, that's awesome. Oh, we're going to the rat. Yep, Zemo's going to be like, did you do it? Good, good, good. Who's in here? He's happy. Are we gonna? S oh, we didn't see who's in here. Like, I thought it was gonna end with a big reveal and reveal. Oh, interesting. What did you? Ish, ish, ish. Apparently, she's a Black Widow. Like, that was supposed to be her first appearance. Is she going to be like the Nick? Is he getting a new suit? US agent? So is she, she going to be like the Nick Fury of the Thunderbolts or something? Ooh! ooh. I love the suit. I love it. Yeah. A US agent? Yeah, see. 
USA. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> I get it now. US agent. Oh, he's gonna go and confess. There we go. The big emotional payoff. Oh, this is gonna hurt, isn't it? Oh, they call cool. the cops on him. Not as emotional as I thought it would be. What's that, Doctor Ray? Okay. Right, cross them. Osman, Zemo, Herrickson. No, Zemo's crossed off. Yeah, Her I finished the book, thanks for all your help, Doc. Is he going to that kill? Well, he's keeping an eye out. Is, he, is this Isaiah? Is Are we going to get a Patriot set up? I want a psychic. <laughs> oh, is it going to reload? Oh, did he update it? The museum. He's probably put his information in there, like...
put his statue up there. Dyer Bradley. Ah, oh. oh, they know he's. Is he gonna punch him? Like, who told you to do that? He's gonna hit him. Yeah. Uh, oh, that that was a good emotional payoff. Because these scenes hurt the most, man, when I was watching this live. His character made me cry, man. It's just sad. Is it over? Nope. What's going to be the end credit scene, man? That's what I'm like. Yeah, my God, my God, see it. Captain America and the Winter... Oh, okay. Oh, yeah. And the Winter Soldier. I thought they were changing the White Wolf or something. Captain America and the Winter Soldier. That was great, man. Oh, my God. That was beautiful. So, I'm assuming we're going to get a season two called that. Captain America and the Winter Soldier. <laughs> Because that was one of my theories, like, this is going to end, and, like, they're going to get, like, a nice swap. I was hoping for White Wolf, but, okay. Oh, man, what is the, what is the end credit scene going to be? General Ross going to Zemo saying, I'm putting together a team. Sharon Carter putting together a team. Come on, man. Seriously, this was uh, this was one of the best episodes. It did get a bit preachy, but I was kind of expecting that, like considering the t uh, the subject matter. So it was expected. I like the suit. I like Walker suit. I like he redeemed himself. Like he made the right decision in the end. I'm hoping he's not going to be a complete bad guy. Do you know what I mean? Like, obviously, there's going to be struggles, I think. But so far, so good, I think. Zemo did get the last laugh at the end with the... <laughs> that was great. So yeah, Baltruck is dead. Damn. That was unexpected. You'd think they would have been they would have like hyped him up to be part of the team, but no. Here we go, guys. There we go. Captain America and the Winter Soldier. Uh Interesting. She still wants revenge, right? Like... Ooh. Ooh. 
Ooh, that music. Oh God. Was that it? That was kind of disappointing. Please tell me there's an end credit scene at the end. Because that was disappointing. That was, that was disappointing. So, that was the final episode of Falcon and the Winter Soldier. In my opinion, it wrapped up a hell of a lot better than uh, WandaVision did, okay? Every character got essentially got the conclusion. Zemo did accomplish his goal of wiping out the uh, Flag Smashers. Um, oh, <laughs> Walker redeemed himself, as I already mentioned, and he's now officially the US soldier. And Falcon Sam has officially become Captain America, and his suit is badass. So we ended up getting essentially two origin stories here, basically. U.S. Agent and Captain America, so that's good. It is good. It worked out well. And Bucky, you know, he redeemed himself. He's kind of getting over that stuff, you know. He, he accomplished his goal, so that's done. In a way, those stories are essentially, in a way, over. Like, their arcs are over. Like, I can't, I don't see what, I, I can't see what they can do more with now at this point, besides just having them sort of cameo in the other movies or team up films now but good so far so good and sharon being the power broker i think i said this in episode three maybe because the episode was called the power broker and we never saw the power broker unless big twist the power broker was there the whole time in this in which case you know it was either gonna be zemo or sharon and sharon was was the most obvious one for it to be it so yeah um unexpected which means and this is very interesting does that mean that sharon uh, that zemo knew she was the power broker like he must have right he must have and he just sort of played along keeping his mouth shut and that because like we saw what happened to Baltrug. the moment he found out she was the power broker like and demanding more money and that she killed him without hesitation so maybe, maybe it's a case of you know if you don't if you're not loyal to the power broker whatever you're gonna die like you're gonna open your mouth you're gonna die and in this case zemo was like i'm keeping my mouth shut because i know if I say anything, she's going to kill me. So I'm keeping it shut and I'm uh, showing the respect. And that's good, you know, fair enough. But yeah, very unexpected that they made Sharon a, a bad a villain, basically. Essentially, she is the mastermind of this of this entire situation. She's the one who made that, uh, you know, got that dude uh, to create the Super Soldier Serum and essentially create these guys and create the whole situation that happened. And she was essentially just, what, what's, what's the word? Uh fixing her own problem essentially so yeah that's unexpected that they turned sharon into a bad guy all because of the whole situation that happened with after civil war and then the so uh, so called you know uh, uh, accords so that's insane like that's insane like they've done that like well what's that what's that going to be like when sam and bucky themselves find out like oh my god like i'm surprised we didn't see steve in this like i i guess he's i guess he's really dead or he he used he used these I don't know he used the the time transporter thing to go back into that past into that timeline and resume his old life in that world like we I mean the way they kept saying that he's on the moon and that like they they really downplayed it the whole time like we don't know if he actually is dead I'm assuming he went back to that to that alternative uh, uh world of his like uh, that that he went to to get married with Peggy and that so he's, he's he probably got a big family there so he's probably going back to that so multiverse stuff maybe maybe we'll get like some sort of multiverse uh Captain America maybe they'll go back there you know Wanda and, and Stephen Strange and maybe we'll see old Cap in that film like and we find out that there's all these different heroes in that you in that alternative reality that he's going to like I don't know it'll be interesting to see what how they do it but Good final, man. Good final. I really liked it. And I'm looking forward to seeing Black Widow next, which should be the next Marvel property coming out. <laughs> um, actually, when is that coming out? Uh, that's supposed to come out, like, around now, no? Or has it been... It's going to be on Disney+, Plus, right? So we can all, we can all watch it on there. Uh, 
what's the release what's the release date for this movie now uh 9th of july oh isn't so that's coming out in july and loki's coming out in june isn't it so sorry about this guys i'm just uh trying to find out what the release date for this is does it not say what where's the release date for this Loki is scheduled to premiere on June. Okay, so Loki is next. My bad. Loki is next. And yeah, we basically don't have anything now uh, for the remainder of April. We have nothing in May. Oh my god, we have nothing in May. <laughs> oh, that hurts, man. Oh boy. Um, yeah. And then we have to wait to halfway, like near, near the halfway point, near the halfway point for June to get the next MCU uh, um, dose of ours. But yeah, that was fun, man. I liked it. I liked it. Very good episode. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you liked my reaction to it. As always, like and subscribe. Guys, I can't wait to continue this. This was fun. I think I'm going to do more reactions to the MCU when it comes out. Maybe I'll do the, movie, the Black Widow movie, maybe. But yeah, I love this, guys. I hope you liked it, too. And I shall see you when I shall see you. Take care. And yeah, take care and bye. <laughs>